Hello my friends and welcome to another Tuesday of Tutorial. I am Leonardo Perez Nieto and today we will draw a face with light and shadow like under a tree. I begin with the eye, first marking just a few straight lines like a diamond and part of a circle on top, then the other and lightly the nose, mouth and the shape of the face. She will be leaning on a tree. Let's sketch the eyebrows and the outline of the hair. We can now come back and round and give a better shape to the straight guidelines that we have drawn. We make the iris and the pupil, the eyelids for both eyes and refine and reinforce the lines a little bit. I am adding a link on the screen for a tutorial on how to easily draw an eye. I'm working with the 2 to 3 mechanical pencil. We draw the pupil and I switch left to a softer one to achieve the blacks, leaving a little white reflection to give it some life. The list of materials that I am using is in the description below the video. Let's switch back to a medium hardness lead to do the rest of the shading. And remember that even to the white of the eye, you should give it a shade. Let's give a tone to the eyebrows and then draw the second eye in the same way as we did the first one. Very good. Since the eyes are in a recess, above them there is usually a shade. Let's also give a slight shade to the nose and then most of the rest of the face will be in shadow but we will leave some areas of light as if it was coming through the foliage of a tree. And let's sketch the hair. I did the first layer of the tone of the face very lightly mainly to see how it could look. Now I darkened it. And we also darken the hair. I want all this shading to look soft, so I smudge it a little bit with a brush. It is a synthetic, soft, although not super soft, brush. All right. And we switch back to the soft one for this dark shade that the tree trunk is projecting on the face. Very good. I love drawing so much. I will darken the shadows of the hair and pretty much all the shading, so that we can appreciate better the lights. Now we just give some texture to the trunk of the tree, which is easy because it is very uneven. If you made it all the way to this point, I would love to know it. Please write me in the comments the secret code hiding under a tree. We leave some areas of sunlight as well on the trunk and then we pull some little lights on the hair. For this I use a pen eraser and a kneaded eraser. And it's ready! If you enjoyed it, please give it a like, subscribe to Fine Art Tips if you haven't done so already, click on the little bell to get notifications of new videos, and I will see you with more art on Tuesday.